Strike people. Blue Beetle final trailer. Now I cannot really understand why this movie's been made, to be honest. Um James Gunn I know he had great success with Guardians of the Galaxy. Um but Guardians of the Galaxy, uh unless you were like a massive comic book fan, you perhaps wouldn't have maybe heard of him. But he had a lot going for it. For starters, just the title Guardians of the Galaxy. Sounds kind of intriguing, doesn't it? You know. Um, so for the, like the the normal normies out there, the, the people that like the superior films or uh, science fiction or just some fun space adventure, um, you know, and you saw the trailers to that, and it's the uh, eclectic mix of different characters. You know, Rocket Raccoon, um, Groot, I had to think about that, I am Groot. You know, even though he doesn't, well, he doesn't say anything other than I am Groot, but he's got a, a, a personality all of his own. The way in which he sort of walks uh, and... I know he's a CGI character, but he, he they've done a good job of, um, you know, displaying his uh, emotions. You know, you've got uh, Star Lord, who is a character all on his own. Uh, I really like Gamora. Uh, Drax, yeah, made me laugh. Uh, I liked Nebula, I thought she was brilliant. You know, I heard somebody say they, they could have just had a, a, an hour of them in a room talking and it would have been fun to watch, you know. I think they, they pulled off something good there, but, you know, they were a group of very different characters with different personalities that was fun and it was different and it was enjoyable and yeah it it, it took a, a, a bunch of fairly obscure characters and made them household name now this is a very obscure character and I think only the most Die hard of DC comic readers probably would come across it, and uh, I think you know it, it, this is just going to be a, a, a one off. It's obviously aimed at a younger audience. Um, by judging by the trailer, it's got that awful Disney Marvel comedy. Well, I don't even call it comedy. The, the little quippy uh, jokes or whatever. You know. You know. Um, yeah, they're just. In, in a Guardians of the Galaxy, it's set in space, obviously, it's fantasy, science fiction, sort of, or, as, as I'd put it, uh, science fantasy. You know, this, this just looks uh, just a, another generic superhero type knockoff, like, they've just taken some... Uh, yeah, characters and 
you know, you've seen it with Shazam now, you know, he, he, he gets his, given these powers, you know, young lad gets these powers that he can't quite grasp, you know, and ends up having to become the hero. You know, um, Max Payne, uh, oh, the list goes on, you know, it, it, it's nothing new. Um, and, well, I'm just going to play the video, uh, the, the trailer, and uh, let's see. I want to fly. Oh, let's do this. Oh. Yeah! Straight away, you know, with the crappy comedic crap. You gotta force it to I, come out. What are you. <sighs> You're a genius. Well, I know. But what I say? No, 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 no. Did you know what was going to happen to my brother when you stuck him with this world-destroying thing? It, it, it's like the original Spider-Man. It's called the Scarab. I had no idea it would activate. It has to choose you. So how do we get it to unchoose me? Host acquired. Who said that? Systems checking. Three, okay. two, three. Okay. It's just a goofy teen movie, and to be honest, if I was still a teen, I would look at this and think, what is this immature crap? What do you think the government is going to do when they figure out that some kid has this military tech? Bust it down, bust it down. We are going to change the world with the power of the scarab. It belongs to me. Watch out, watch out! Oh, he's pissed. Listen to me! Uptown, baby. It's, uh, what you call it? Maximilian. From the, uh, Black Hole. You got the wrong guy! I'm a nobody! But I swear! I was down when they see I'm up now, baby. The world is a place to protect. I have an arsenal at my disposal. Anything, please! Watch and learn, Jaime. Whoa. Whatever you can imagine, I can create. Yeah, that's more like it. Oh, yeah! The love you feel for your family makes you weak. You're wrong. My family? That's what makes me strong. <gasps> oh, I forgot how bad it looks. Target the family. And what I hate is the these ones where the family get involved, but none of the family ever get hit or killed or whatever. It's just pointless. Sorry, my mom. I am it. You are a superhero, cabron. Y'all take shots. You're the Blue Beetle. I could use that arsenal right about now. God, you never ask. Hell yeah. Let me try to stop the way. I'm not going to lie, the CGI looks uh, pretty good, actually. 
as far as DC films go, uh, that actually looks pretty, uh, CJ looks pretty good. Um, can't remember the guy's name, uh, Miguel from Cobra Kai, he's a good actor, um, not sure, well, obviously, yeah, he, he's, he's got that sort of uh, happy-go-lucky type of vibe to him, which I suppose, you know, with this film being uh, PG-13. So, yeah, clearly aimed at the younger audience. It's just the younger audience, this mythical modern audience, the 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 ideologues aren't gonna come out and support this, and I can't see the my generation, uh, like you know, who used to read the comics and 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 that you know, we're just not into this new Marvel type stuff now and and whatnot, you know, this uh everything has to be light hearted and funny, you know, not nothing's ever, you know don't mind a better better you know, can comedy or whatever, better bit of a laugh or whatever, but you know, it has to be a bit serious and uh you know and and even though it's uh, you know clearly fantasy, like, there still has to be sort of rules, like you know how people just get punched through walls, like they're made of paper, and come out the other end with, with, without even a scratch, and and that it, it, you know it, just not really uh, for the for the older generation uh, and. Like, I can't see the young people either. Like, oh, Dad, can you take me to watch the Blue Beetle? It looks amazing. You know, uh, I really want to go and watch it. No, it, it's. I think this is just going to be another flop buster. Um, I certainly won't be going to watch it at the cinema. Um, but when it becomes available on demand and I can watch it at home or whatever, I, I shall definitely give it a go, like. But what do you think? Uh, yeah. Is it uh, getting your heart, heart pounding, you know? Or, oh, oh, I really want to go and watch that. That trailer looked amazing. Mm, yeah. Anyway, thank you for listening. Please subscribe, share, hit that like button, smash them uh, potatoes, and uh, see you on the next one. Thank you very much. Peace.